Let's do top secret. Okay. So first up, top secret, um, we're going to just play these videos. They're um, our upcoming uh, camera things that are working mm. on. And then we have um, a couple little surprises. So we'll see you on the other side. Okay, Lady Ada, what is this? Oh, no, I'm trapped inside of this Grand Central. Help, help, get me out. No, just kidding. This is a, a camera that I'm testing out here. And this is me. It's, it's pointed at me, and that's why I look like I'm in the screen. Uh, what's interesting about this is we're doing parallel image capture from this camera, this OV7670, through the Grand Central, and then displaying it onto this TFT. And it's like, you know, seven, eight frames per second real time. All happening in CircuitPython. So we're actually getting the image capture um, and data um, being transferred through the CircuitPython core. We're going to be able to use cameras now for, of course, taking photos, but also for, you know, maybe machine learning or AI or um, image recognition projects uh, using these really common OV7670 cameras. So this is SAMD51 parallel capture uh, image support for cameras in CircuitPython. Hello, it's me. I'm so small, trapped inside of this little screen. Uh, you just showed off, we've got OV7670 support for CircuitPython on the SAMD51, but did you know that the RP2040 in the Raspberry Pi Pico can also read parallel cameras? This is 8-bit parallel data coming through an OV7670 uh, parallel capture camera. Uh, yeah, we can use PIOs to do that, and we do. And this is actually all in CircuitPython, so you're watching me, uh, my image being captured through the Pico in CircuitPython, and then that uh, byte array being written out to the, the display over here, over SPI. Now it's a little posterized, we gotta figure out exactly what's going on, uh, but this is our first uh, pull request, just testing it out um, for Jepler, and it looks, it looks really good, and it's pretty fast. So that's me in CircuitPython doing video. Next Hi. up, we're working on Keeb. We get More some keeps. Keeb, 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 Boars. This is an RP2040 macro pad with 3x4 keys. Uh, it's got a 128x64 OLED or a TFT. I'm kind of like still deciding. Um, and a rotary encoder. So it's kind of like a cute little macro. I've seen a lot of these adorable macro pads. And I like the idea that it like has a screen, has a rotary encoder, and like 12 keys that you can customize. These have socketed keys with NeoPixel. So you can pick whatever kind of MX compatible keys you like. That's up to you. Ooh, coming soon. Don't ask. It's not out yet. All right.